I remember a day, Christmas in 1995, when we were at home and I was looking for my wife, I couldn't find her. And she had gone into labor. <laughs> and we went over to Middleburg Heights. We stayed there all night. And at 12.25 in the morning, my first son, Antonio, was born. So Cleveland will always hold a special part of my life because of that. It's been great since I've been here. The atmosphere down there, I actually went downtown doing a Browns game. And I was here when the Browns left the first time. So to come back and actually be downtown doing a Browns game. Downtown, the whole, everywhere downtown was great. Wow, I think is the, when you think about it, it's the word. Because in a lot of places that the, like everything downtown is totally different from when I was here. So just as far as like the facilities, um, the, the places, I mean, that they built to live in, the, the restaurants, the arena, the energy. We had a lot of energy when I was here before, but it's nothing like this. So if I, the word, if you can just say like the word, is just like for me, I'm just like amazed basically how the city has really grown. I'm, I'm a little biased about the fans. I think that, I mean, you look at every sport that's here and how the fans follow them. I think they're some of the best fans in the world. And I, I really have a, a, a different feel because I've actually played for them and they've always supported us, even when we, I mean, we weren't bad, but um, they always support the product that we put out there. And the community really, really backs us and the community's really behind us, so I love the fans. Good people, good food. Uh, my friends are still here, thank God. Uh, and great fans. I just the, the good the good people um, aspect of it is is the same.